Necrosis. And this is locked up. It has a very suspicious PT knockoff vibe to it. But it also has this VHS post-processing filter, which is pretty cool. Also means seizure warnings, because if, if, if you're prone to epilepsy, heads up. This one's gonna mess you up, most likely, if it doesn't mess me up. It doesn't work with my Reba Tuner statistic server, so I don't get a little overly, or frame limiter. And it also launched my freaking VR software, even though it's not a VR game. Two things I hate about Unreal Engine with indie developers. <laughs> it's supposed to be made by one guy. I'm just going to hit new game and let's see what the heck we got ourselves into. I'm a big sucker for the VHS pulse processing, for those of you not familiar. Movie time. Mm. Wait, no it's not. This is the game. Yep. Holy fuck, the input delay is absurd. Classic, every game has to start with a car broken down or parked in the middle of a forest right outside a... I'm assuming that's a building. Apparently the middle mouse is for zooming. Is this me flashlight? It is. How do I use it? No battery indicator. Hey, this could be good. Missing child, Martha Foster. All the police department. No, thank you. This is supposed to be the setting. My investigator with the VHS camera on the hunt for missing child report. Yeah, they went really heavy on the post processing with this one. Hope it's not too disorienting. things from Resident Evil 4? Hey wait, they hung a witch. Where there's a hung body, there must be an upskirt to be had if I could get there. But I can't. I mean, the visual rep um, um, uh, presentation is really nice so far. Wish it was a little tamer on the glitching. But that's going to get a little too much, I think, over time. There's no limit on the flashlight. It's already way less boring than the last game I played. Cigarettes or playing cards? Cigarettes. So it must be in an age before e-cigarettes was a thing. Are like that. I don't know, Martha's probably the kid. I was thinking more like, I got two mommies. I'm better than you. And they look for the one person that has like two fathers and then they just don't get along with each other. Some sort of game console war. Two 
Two moms are way Two moms are way better than two dads. No, uh Two dads are way better. Let me guess I'm locked in here now. Yep. It's gonna take a while to guess that this is a fake shell and that there might be a door or something behind it. Or not. What am I doing? Yeah, that didn't do anything. So what am I supposed to do? Is there an item I missed? Why is there footsteps on the table? Who the fuck is walking on this? Let's see, is there a crouch? No, and there's no jump either. I guess I'm not expected to go above or underneath objects. I don't know what I am expected to do, though. This room has no other rooms connected to it. No, we, wish we looked at the trailer. There's a whole bunch of stuff. This is not it. There's some sort of event flag I guess I would have to trigger. I just don't know what it is. Maybe it's time-based. Maybe they think the longer I spend in here not knowing what to do, it's not going to make me more aggravated. And Oh, I click on this. This is going to hop into you. What is it? A knight? Hey, there's something happening. Hey, you. Do something scary. Scare me, you little bitch. What else you got? That's it. I'm a vengeful, angry spirit who can't move on past death. I'm gonna show you just how angry I am. See this chair? Yeah. Blah. Sort of like poltergeist stuff seems to me like. I can't move right now, so. Maybe I'm supposed to turn off the flashlight? Nope, can't do that either. Hey, the cult's all gathered. And the chairs have rearranged themselves again. Oh dear. Oh me. Get out of my life, it says. I'm sure the response to that was, she's a witch, let's burn her or hang her. It's like everybody's taking the pose from what's-her-face from the PT thing. The, the PT demo. can't do anything right now, so... The footage ends there. Okay. I'm not sure what to make of that. The amount of glitchiness in the VHS thing was very disorienting, so that kind of makes it hard to... think clearly, but looks like we ditched the camera. It's kind of a shame. I thought that was the, the selling point. I mean, be, oh. Well, this is our life. We're just gonna live in this room until we die. Uh, or we're just gonna open every, or attempt to open every shelf. Classic Unity style gameplay. On a convenient Unreal Engine form factor. That still don't work. Sounds like somebody on the other side is trying to open it too. Like, hey, it's not working on my side either. Sorry. Oh, now this opens. 
this looks like some kind of a... Alright. So let's remember this. A line, an equal sign, and a C. Well, well, let's say one equals C. That's how I'll remember that symbol. We turn it sideways. Kind of looks like Whitebeard's mustache from One Piece. Or no, maybe upside, up, upright. Forget if his mustache goes wink or wonk. Oh, I guess we don't have to remember that symbol anymore. It's been, it's been written down on the wall. It's still broken. Oh wait, there's something else over there. Now they give me instructions. Left mouse to interact. Right, I'll turn it. Interactions, so to pick up. Open the door with a key. Oh, shit. Okay. Flashlight. Camera. Lighter. Oh, camera might be related to puzzles or something. Turn the lighters, if you just want to do like a self-immolation protest. This wasn't here a moment ago. Ah, oh, boy. It's one of those games. You guys remember the movie? What the? It was the prequel to it. Oh, fuck. So everything's going to keep changing as you turn around. That was my biggest complaint and frustration with Layers of Fear 2. Okay, so there's no camera. V, there's no lighter. And there's no flashlight right now. We do have a lot of light source, so I'm not worried about it yet. Try right click. Okay, right click does nothing. I really want to watch that tape though. What the? Oh, wait. So I can click it. Found a box from the previous owners. Once you. Th there's six question marks. Is that relevant? I have to be really pixel hunty if I want to know what to click. Kind of sounds like a horse galloping. Isn't it? I was going through my tabs yesterday. I found a meme image. Just a movie cover, like a poster. New folder three from the makers of new folder one and two. Oh, okay, so zooming in on stuff does stuff too. Is it a Celtic rune? I'm not familiar. 2.25 a.m. I got a bad feeling about the... Ew. April 9th, 92. They look like cult people for lack of a better description. Searches for cult members are underway. I can do it. Uh, Dardanelles Fort at something worships long-range guns. U.S. firms are aiding British. It is charged. Streamer hits mine. Oh, steamer hits mine. Sings crusade. Wow, these articles are terrible. Catholic clergy in Mexico City help for ransom. Hundreds were armed. Nothing has happened. Sounds like the last game I played. Tons of horror. Nothing happened. Deep psychology. I don't think the book would be thicker than that. I guess I can't access anything with it. Unless I can zoom in on it. Nope. It looks like as if we're in some sort of detective office. Nothing to interact with. Just like suspects or victims. Expressway almost.
For the record, I am not a fan of the PT knockoff genre style. Because I fucking hate it. <laughs> and PT was cool, but nothing else. Basically a pixel hunt of the what's changed when I turned around variety, which is not a particularly enticing mechanic. At least we can shoot ourselves if we need to. Well, there's no bullets in. Or no, there they are. There's reflected. Can I not take it? No. What's the point of me looking at it? Kids. Even during the days of black and white photography, people made mistakes. Hey, this news is a new force. Nothing, 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 nothing. This is different. There is no lake. Great. It's like, I just have to keep looking at stuff and turning around is what this is boiling down to at the moment. Which is really, really not fun. It's going to get really frustrating really fast. Like that photo's gone. I don't know what good that does us. was a complete guessing game trial and error of something. I just don't know what. Wait a minute. Oh no, I thought I thought that was her thumb. Do you mind I'm trying to Eh, fuck it, whatever. <laughs> being exercised. The illuminated millennium. More cult peoples. I think they recruited me in their creepy cult. It's up to me to click on everything and keep turning around and resorting to drugs. And unfiltered cigarettes. We stop doing this with the light before I freaking get epilepsy, please. What's the time on the clock? Still 2.25. I was just trying to point out on that picture, I thought the thumb was on the wrong side of the hand. But I think the... It wasn't a thumb, it was just the side of her... the sleeve of her... Uh, outfit. Oh, uh, it's not good for my eyes. My brain's going not like this anymore. Yeah, if I start foaming... If it looks like I fell, don't send help. Just assume the worst. I don't know what else there is for me to click or physically look at. This was mostly positive on Steam. Lord here. I don't have a 
flashlight. Can I just have this? No, I guess that works. Frame rate's fucked. Yeah, this whisper is a copyrighted audio track. I remember because it's used in a lot of indie games. It's just whispering. There's a, tr there's a track name for it and everything. The group that owns it. It's just whispering. But freaking YouTube. YouTube will smash me down for it. I mean the Necronomicon? The book? Oh shit. Maybe it is. I'll take it. See, Ori would like this. She's really big into the Lovecraft stuffs. I mean, I just play a lot of games that have Lovecraft in, in, in the tags. <laughs> and I'm just like, I don't know what relation this has to anything. I usually scream by the end, no more, no less rather than like a hundred times the name Cthulhu. I like Cthulhu. Photograph of the pictures, is it still, yep, it's still 225. It does look like the Necronomicon though, doesn't it? Not, not necessarily V, but the one that you always see in fiction and stuff. So he has like a face type of thing beveled into it and stuff and people go crazy and all sorts of cool shit happens. Maybe it's just based on time. Like I'm not even triggering anything, I'm simply running the clock till it gets to like the five minute mark or something and then it... Unless this is a hint, it looks like it's focused on that thing with the tentacles coming out of its back. Do we have one that does that? Yes we do, that one. I can't click it. I can zoom in on it a little bit. I was able to click on that and even realize it. Hunt. 
It's like the only thing I can click on on the on the table. Back of the photo. Oh, there was nothing on it. Uh, it's just blank. Unless you mean one of these photos, but I looked at all of them. There's nothing on them either. They're just made out of wood. I can't zoom it on it. If I hold the middle mouse, it just lets me move it like this for some reason. But that doesn't really help us. But there's nothing there. It's not a time-based event. This has been way too much time, so what is it? Maybe I have to be exact in what I zoom in on? Are you scared yet? Flashlight. There's no camera or lighter either. Oh, wait, what? When I clicked on that candle, I, when was I able to do that? What the fuck? I swear I couldn't click on those before. Also, I can't see now. Hey, those awful whispers are gone. But so is everything else. Yes, it looks as if it's pacing back and forth. Is that a hint? Maybe they want me to face this way, and then go this way. Like, we learned how to program it so that when you turn around, things look different. Let's make a whole game out of it. And try to induce epilepsy on the user, because that's always fun. People love strobe lights. Two years ago, I did have a seizure, though, so I have to be careful. Look. Look at what? These bodies I can't, they're covered with some sort of bag. Can you look at the word look? Oh, cockroaches? I can influence where they move. Can we please stop flashing the lights? Changing just by physically me walking back and forth. I just want the fucking flashing lights to stop. Well, I'm gonna pause it for just a sec, because... I, I might actually get myself into trouble physically if I stare at flashing lights for too long. That's not a joke, like... Legit. It's hard to be scared when you're just sitting there being aggravated, though. Okay, let's go. Oh, fucking gun. Let's close this completely so that I can never 
fucking have to deal with that shit again. It's like I can feel like my brain is like almost pulsing with it. it like, it's hard to explain. It's just like the inside of your perceptions start to pulse. Kind of like as if you're on a roller coaster trying to draw a painting or a picture, just writing a story with a pencil. It's like, good luck. Drugs, wallets, cookies. Got everything you could ever need here. I guess this is where it's gonna turn into Uber PT. Not scary. Why is this photo here? Get rid of that one. Put in something creepy. Oh, fuck. Okay, thank you. I just don't want any more flashing lights, please. Thanks. Hey, this is locked. I wonder if anything changes if I turn around. I still not. No flashlight. No, nothing. Mm, let's go in the darkness, but I have to walk backwards so I can actually reference. Better get a flashlight before I leave. Why don't you just give me one? Where is a flashlight? Is there one in my coat? See something there. Can't turn. Oh, staring at this picture of an open shelf. Opened the shelf. They gave me a solid chrome dildo. I'll take that. Yeah, not bad. My frame rate's fucked, but otherwise, not bad. Is, look Look at how much more horror this is now. Just having a flashlight. Mm. Yeah, it's also used for, well, the static stuff is also used for EVP. Basically just kind of like a randomness and hoping to find something that just happens to arrange itself in a... Well, thinking of it scientifically, not paranormally, because I don't buy that BS personally, but I do like to make fun of it at the very least. Same concept, like, yeah, if you put a bunch of random static on a screen, and they keep rearranging themselves, sooner or later they'll rearrange themselves into something. You give it an infinite amount of time... Then it'll rearrange itself into every possible configuration. It's just infinity. And then that's where I start talking about Boltzmann brains and stuff for hours and hours, but nope. Not today. We have a rope. And no more shelves. Art, art, and more art. And drugs. Also, not really art, they're just photographs, but I guess sometimes art can be photography. Maybe if I turn around and go the other way again, everything's going to fucking change because that's a great idea. <laughs> Do I sound a little whiny? <laughs> Don't worry, if I sound agitated, it's because I am. Yep, that all changed just by walking back and forth through the corridor. Boy, do I know how to pick my games. <laughs> Yipes. That's, I guess, the game loop, though, is walk back and forth. I 
If you hear new noises or see new things, great. Now it sounds like a bunch of rustling bugs or something in the walls. How much you want to bet this room right here is a bathroom? I bet you it is. Can't run either. That looks new. Are you new? Yeah, you're new. More photographs of those cult people's families. I don't get who thought this was such a good idea for a gameplay element. I just. going on there. I'm literally just walking back and forth in a hallway. And some of the time, something changes. It's only based on the walking, however, or if I have to click on every possible thing and stare at every possible object each time as well. Got more of those roaches. The door still don't work. Turn around. I don't think the candles were there. Still better than the last game I played. I'll give it that. However, the input delay on the mouse. Oh, it's so bad. Which is part of what makes the hunting of what can I click on that much worse. Frustrating. Do I influence these guys' movement? No. Uh, a little bit. Not by what feels any significant amount. Is there probably not a gameplay element? Just for people who don't like cockroaches. Doesn't seem like anything's changing now. That's now different. There's someone over there. Maybe I can walk up and punch her in the fucking head. Nope. Frame rate is tanking hard. <laughs> Maybe I should turn the graphic settings down a little. I think right now it's set to ultra. <laughs> Wait. No. The 
This game is called Locked Up. Can be by one guy. And I guess he's played or seen somebody play PT and decided I want to make a game that does something like that too. As many did. Nobody realizing exactly why PT was the sort of masterpiece that it was. Which is why I generally am not a fan of PT style games. Not from indies. Where they take the wrong parts and I think that's what made it great. And I am in high disagreement. Not sure if anything changed. their shoes, shoe marks, but then they stop right there. And that other room, it did kind of hint that, where did this picture fall from anyways? Oh, right, the, the jump scare. Anything's changing. I'm expected to do something, but what? If I know. <laughs> Yikes. Cannot click on the candles. Cannot interact with anything there. What does the word hate have to do with anything? Unknown at this time. What if something changes if I turn the flashlight off? I guess nothing. Oh, maybe that might be a thing. As some sort of, like, event trigger. Still 225. It's always 225. Difference there. I don't know if the footprints are supposed to be a hint as to where you're supposed to keep walking back and forth, like a tiger pacing in its cage because it's been kept in captivity. Ooh. 
These cows weren't here before, were they? Oh, maybe they were. Oh, boy. to do. Nothing's changing every like just by walking back and forth, but there's nothing to interact with. The only things that can be attempted to be interacted with are these stupid drawers and the doors, but none of it opens or works. Let me see something. Nope. The cross has nothing to do with nothing. say. There's nothing to say. There's nothing to do. There's legitimately nothing to do. the game goes. Everything that was in the trailer is just not, you know, just, just there by accident. The one review I was looking at is any indication the goal is to be looking at the pictures and shit happens. The problem is we don't have any, like, normal pictures, just the, like, the framed stuff on the wall. Is this gonna happen? No? Okay. Are there any other pictures or Polaroids or artist renditions? Anything. Anything. I mean, we got this thing on the ground. Doesn't really do anything. Somehow based on the angle. No. 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 Still no. And no. And no. Nope. Yes, yeah, so there's nothing else here. I don't think there's any game here. <laughs> I really don't. There's nothing. Checking these stupid fucking candles, see if that's anything. It is not. Great. No, there's just nothing. If nothing happens by the time I walk down that hall and back. Game over. I 
Alright, game, this is your last chance. Do something by the time I get to the other side of this hall. Anything. Anything. Nothing. Yep. That's game over. Well, that was terrible. The trailers for it looked interesting. The beginning of the game had the VHS stuff, which I love so much. The technical end. Mouse acceleration can't be turned off, so I was bitching about that right off the bat. Every time I move the mouse, there's smoothing because they thought that was a good idea. RTSS won't hook in, so the frame limiter doesn't apply or my overlays. That's a personal problem that drives me nuts, as well as that it launches my Rift software in the background, which it cannot be closed or the game will close. Now the game itself, visually it looks fine at least with the post-processing stuff, but the gameplay sucks. It took like the single most annoying concept out of the PT formula and just made it worse. Not only that, there's no hint system or anything that can help you stay on track and make progress. It looked in the trailers as if there was lots more to it, but I don't have the patience. I don't have, apparently, the ability to because I don't know what the fuck they want me to do. I hate it.